yes, indeed, we are in a poly crisis. So there are lots of different angles where our economy, our societies, but especially the industry is under threat. And here, I think we need a clear view what we want to achieve as the European Union, as the different member states. And I think we already took that decision. We want to be climate neutral in 2050. This is a great target. This is earlier than other regions in the world. But in order to get there, we now need to concentrate on the right mix of technologies. There's no silver bullet. I'm representing hydrogen. Even hydrogen is not the one and only technology. It is an enabler and it needs to be seen with other technologies together. What we need is to shorten the time to decarbonize. After the many years of crisis and a clear test to resilience, in my opinion, uh, keep going strong is one of the main challenges for the industry. So keeping up with the rhythm and the focus towards green and uh, clean energy is one of the main objectives. For that, we have to see that all of the regulatory frameworks that incentivize industry towards it have to be in place. It is a challenge both from the industry itself to react to these regulatory changes, as well as for the policymakers to make changes that adequately reflect the realities in each of the markets. If we want to win this uh, energy transition process, we need to have everybody aligned. So we need to have the regulators and the policymakers creating the right framework in order to help the investors to put the money that we need to make it happen. We need the people, the consumers, to accept the changes that they are going to face. We cannot impose things to people. We need to create an environment where people want to join the transition rather than feel that somebody is imposing.